and here we are again, part two, unpacking the crate. Uh, this is this uh, handbook for town officer, state controller's office, Albany, New York, Eugene M. Travis Controller, uh, published by J.B. Lyon Company Printers, 1918. My great grandfather was a justice of the peace. National Geographic. <laughs> now this is really old school. Prices effective October 1st, 1959. Yeah, they had maps and all kinds of stuff. I joined the National Geographic Society. Uh, in, in those days you had to be nominated by a current member, and my great-grandfather, Edgar Weaver, was a member of the National Geographic Society, and he nominated me, and at the end of 1962, they accepted my, my membership. Now here's National Geographic publications. See this? <laughs> That's old school National Geographic. That was back before they had all the bullshit. Yeah, well, we'll get into that later. Ah, okay. Recommendation for membership. I, nominating member, street, city, zone, state, am pleased to nominate for membership in the National Geographic Society the persons I have listed below. And in those days, uh, membership was $6.50 a year. Okay, and that is the sort of form that my great-grandfather filled out for me to join the society. Scale model fittings, illustrated catalog, price list number 12. Hmm. I don't know what this is. Huh. Federal Art Project, Division of Arts and Crafts. CCC camps, Governor's Island, New York. Hull templates for clipper ship model. Uh, my great-grandfather, again, Edgar Weaver, was a member of the Civilian Conservation Corps. This is dated 1935. Um, and he, he learned a lot of stuff, like uh, leather. I don't know if he... Um, I mean, he, he, he learned how to make wallets and stuff. I don't know what kind of a carpenter he was before that, but I think he was pretty school, skilled. And he built uh, all kinds of really high quality furniture. High grade steel gaffs. Hmm. W.C. Greg, Gregory William, Wilmington, Ohio. What in the world? This is... Hmm. I don't know, but this is all stuff that my great-grandfather had, and uh, apparently thought enough of it to, to keep it. National Geographic Society. <laughs> I have visited the... National Geographic Society headquarters in Washington, D.C. Uh, at least that was the headquarters at that time. I remember when they built the building. I think it was in the late 60s. The architect said that he liked to put hats on his buildings 
and the National Geographic Society building had a sort of a cap on it. Sheetrock, time book for car carpenters. United States Gypman, Gypsum Company. Hmm. Huh, 1924. Got it. There, if you know. Need to know what happened in 1924. There you go. I mean, on what date? Oh, here's something Grandpa wrote. Chet, Elmo, Chancy, Pierce, uh, Clint. Now, Chet, Chet was Chet Rudes, I believe. And Chancy was Chancy Parslow. Mm. I guess he had to keep, you know, uh, time sheets or something. Safety and logging. Hmm. Issued by the Safety Engineering Department, Employers Mutual Liability Insurance Company of Wisconsin, Employers Mutual Fire Insurance Company, Home Office, Wausau, Wisconsin. Safety and logging. You know, logging is a pretty dang dangerous thing to do. No matter how careful you are. I, I've had friends killed by it. Well, it gives all kinds of... Well, you can see. It gives all kinds of demonstrations of how to do one thing and another. We've barely scratched the surface of the of the crate. Sheetrock time book for carpenters. Again, this is a time book. Right. Oh, Edgar J. Weaver, speculator, New York. Now that's my great grandfather. Ah, uh, one point three tenths miles. One point two and a half miles. East Road, uh, looks like Danny's shuttle work, um, again 1924, oh wow, this stuff is full, this stuff is full of, of uh, figures, Hume, 5550, over O'Neill, twenty-four dollars. Anderson, seventy-five cents. Uh, oh my God, this stuff is freaking priceless. Lodging, two dollars. When uh, I'm not going to look through the rest of it right now. When my great grandfather uh, was uh, getting his CCC training in uh, Manhattan. He watched the Empire State Building being built. He lived at the YMCA and, and saw that being built. This looks like the blueprints. Plans for culvert extension at Lake Pleasant Speculator Road, number 271, station 166 plus 60, Hamilton County, scale five feet each equals one inch. Hmm. 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 Not sure what all that is. But it is priceless. <sighs> Coop walking and condition oh dear now this this unfortunately is uh, I, I'm afraid it's cockfighting coop walking and condition by Al Jones copyright 1938 the feathered warrior Henrietta New York wherever cockers meet the exploits of Al Jones are mentioned 
as proof of the merits of coop walking. Uh, I am not proud to admit this, but my great-grandfather and, to some extent, my grandfather uh, kept fighting roosters. And it's a, it's a horrible, horrible thing. It's, it's like dog fighting. Um, but it was a different time. You know, you just really can't judge them by the sensibilities of today with what we understand. Um, but I remember <laughs> my grandmother had a, uh, a button on the kitchen wall that would ring out in the barn or wherever to warn people, to, to warn my grandparents that uh, somebody was coming and, and, you know, they had to put the fighting cocks away. Constitution bylaws and code of procedure of Sacandaga tribe number 122, improved order of red men, Northville, New York. Hmm. Johnstown, New York, C.M. Smith, Jr. Printer, Southbury Street, 1898. Gosh. I don't have what in the world. An idea that's about. Uh, Department of Taxation and Finance Bureau of Motor Vehicles. New York State Vehicle and Traffic Law, Albany, New York. New York, 1930, and I guess that's traffic laws from 1930. What in the world is this? Where am I going? I don't know. But look, it's stapled and taped and sealed. Hmm. I don't know what is in here. There's writing on it. Huh. I don't know, but that is too precious to open right now. Here, Jackie Ledley from Grandma Grandma. Happy birthday, grandson. This wish for a happy birthday is bringing with it, too, the love and pride that always fills each special thought of you. And it's signed. Hmm. Daki? Oh no, it it, it 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 means Jackie. That means me. Grand Grand Grandma didn't actually sign it. She wrote my name. Oh my God. She died uh, November twenty fifth, nineteen seventy, while I was in France. You and your rupture. The Web Trust Company, Hagerstown, Maryland. Well, I don't give a damn about that. High grade steel gas. Huh. Something from England, Birmingham, England. Hmm. Oh, my great grandfather wrote down $1.50. Uh, I have the faintest idea what a steel gas. Oh, you know what this is? Oh my god. Oh dear. I am very sorry to say. These are spurs for fighting cocks. Lion breeding perpetuating game fowl. 